Today I want to talk about how to link cells within Excel from different workbooks and I'm going to introduce two very unique methods to get this done. Okay, so I want to link cells from this main tab over here and I want to link each of these records to its respective tab. For example, we have an accounts record here. We also have an accounts tab. We have a claims record, we have a claims tab, and we have a users record, and we have a users tab. So I want to link each of these values over here to their respective value in each of these tabs. For example, in the accounts tab, we have accounts. We want to have this number 1000, and we want the numbers to be updated dynamically. So if something changes here, the change will also be reflected in the accounts tab. So here's how I'm going to go about doing this. There are two methods. And here's the first method. The first method is I'll go to each of respective tab. For example, I'll start with the accounts tab and I'll do an equal to and then control page up and then I'll select the value 1000 and then I'll click in enter. And just like that, we got the value 1000 in this particular cell. And each time it's basically updated here, it will also be updated in the accounts tab. Now let's also do the same for the claims tab. Equals control, we have to, I have to obviously click page up twice to go to the main tab, claims, enter. Let's also do it for the users tab. Equals to control page up three times this time. And I'll click the amount for users. So you can see here that these values have been correctly reflected in these three tabs. And if we change a particular value in the main tab, that change will now be reflected in each of these tabs. Let's uh, try that out. For example, let's change the amount for accounts from 1000 to 950 for example and now let's go to the accounts tab you can see the 950 is reflected here okay so this was method number one let's move on to method number two so method number two is as follows I have to right click on the value and click on copy and then I will go to the spreadsheet. This time I'll put it over here. Actually, I'll, I'll delete what's already there. And oh, let's do a copy again. Sorry, it didn't work out. So we do copy and then go to the respective tab and paste. But this time, do a paste as link. So this icon over here, which looks like a chain. Pastes, pastes it as a link and this way the change will be dynamic so it's not just a one-time copy paste every time there's a change to the main tab the change will be reflected here as well and let's do the same for claims I'll delete what's already there sorry so copy paste as link and last but not least, I'm going to do the same for users. Copy. And paste as link. And let's test this one out as well. So let's go, for example, to claims and change this number from 350, say, to 450. And let's go to the claims tab. You can see that the number is correctly reflected here. So here were, these were two very easy methods to basically be able to link cells within Excel from different workbooks. Thanks for watching this video. If you liked it, don't forget to subscribe, like, or leave a comment, and I will see you in my next video.